Hey guys, welcome to my video. For today's tutorial, I will be teaching you how to make the crochet fisherman stitch. To begin, all you're going to need is some yarn and a crochet hook. For this tutorial, you will need to know how to make chains, how to make the slip stitch, and how to work in the back loops. I have videos on all of those and I will have them listed down below. To begin, I have already made a little test swatch here using two different colors, so it's going to be easy to see how the stitch is going to be made. I will have the yarn that I'm using and the hook that I'm using listed down below. For the body of my test swatch, I have already made the fisherman stitch. This is what it is going to look like. If you're starting from the very beginning making chains, you're going to make any number of chains. You're going to make one slip stitch into the second chain from your hook, then one slip stitch into each of the chains across for your first row. I will then show you how to make your second row on the row that I'm currently working and any future rows that you want to make. It is just one row repeated. So in the row that I'm currently working, I have made one chain. You're going to start by making a slip stitch into the first stitch right here, but you're going to work into the back loop. And you are going to repeat that all the way across your row. So you're going to make a slip stitch, but work it into the back loop. Again, we are making one slip stitch into each of the stitches across, but we are only working into the back loops of those stitches. So this is what that row is going to look like. And if you stretch out your work a little bit, you can see how stretchy and ribbed the fisherman stitch ends up being. So like I said, you would repeat this row for any future rows that you want to make. And that is going to be how to make the crochet fisherman stitch. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe for more from me. You can follow me on all social media at crochet me lovely, all one word. Please leave me any feedback down below for future videos and tutorials that you would like to see. Thank you guys so much for being here and have a great day.